Sami. The race will be at his shop. Cassandra, good to see you. Cassandra, good to see you. Get your boats here! Good for the whole... Hello, Luris. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself, if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed Drachmi, Luris. But my family... It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you are going to pay. We both know it. Now the question is, what do I break first? You? Or your merchandise? You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to... to... to a mercenary. Or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. You're right about that. Forget the Drachmi. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. Job to do, Cassandra? Ah. Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. I'm the only one here, but maybe I can help you. <gasps> oh, Cassandra, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the Spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. Kefalus had a spear? Cassandra, surely you've heard this story since you were a child. I didn't have much time for stories. Well, perhaps you didn't. But you know Kefalus founded Kefalonia and started the line of Odysseus. His spear was a gift from the gods. It was said never to miss its target. He must have hidden it in the caves after killing his wife with it. He threw a spear that wouldn't miss at his wife? He was hunting and heard her in the bushes. He thought she was a deer. It's a sad story. Sounds dangerous. Well, only if you throw it at someone. Why do you need a spear? Not thinking of becoming a soldier, are you? Of course not. But think how many people will come to the shrine if we have the Spear of Kefalus. With their donations, I could do so many things. Repair the sanctuary, feed the hungry families in Sami. So, where is this spear? Apparently, it's hidden deep in the caves beneath Kefalonia. There's an entrance north of here. Maybe you can try that way first. That's not much to go on. You have so little faith in the gods. If Kefalus means for us to have the spear, you will find it. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary.
You're running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good, or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Luris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. We have no other choice now. We need a plan. That's what I do best. This will take more than the usual tricks up your sleeve. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Cassandra! Uh, Alexios! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh! Ha! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mistheos with a Havel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you! How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Talking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. She's the silent but deadly type. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. 
They're that good, are they? Wars brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies!
should be extra careful in this area. Cassandra, have you come back to talk about the spear? I have. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? You mentioned the reward. Oh, of course. You've certainly earned it.
Icarus the Slayer. How'd it go with Marcos? How it always goes. I didn't get my money, and I'm running another errand for him. Why do you let him boss you around? He doesn't. He just gets me into situations I have to dig myself out of. Maybe you shouldn't let him do that. Thanks for the advice. You're welcome. What do you want, Phoebe? You know Kausos? The town on the other side of the island? Why? People there are sick. And my friend Kina is too. There is a blood fever. They say it's a curse and they need help from the gods. I told you, I'm not a god. But Icarus... ...is a bird. That doesn't mean you can't help. Ugh. All right. I'll look into it.
Ah, here you are, and not a moment too soon. The Cyclops is more important than a boyer. We need to talk. Precisely what I was thinking. Let's hope Drusilla has a good sense of humor. Well, your plan? Right. The Cyclops and I have a score of Drach me to settle. The same score as you, my rough and tumble friend. He wouldn't be after me if it wasn't for you, my friend. <laughs> eh, right. But I swear, this will put an end to it. If he insists on sending his goons after us, we'll make sure his last good day was yesterday. It's not a war. It's a pissing match. You know just how to hurt me, Cassandra. It's not that hard. Trust me. Think. What does the Cyclops value most? His men? His land? His ships? No, his obsidian eye. Get to the point, Marcos. Oh, fine. We're going to steal it. Are you crazy? You borrow his drachme, then you steal his eye? Having it means we win. Then it goes to market. We kill two birds with one obsidian eye. <laughs> He'd better hold still. Or he'll lose both eyes. No, no! It has to be done without the Cyclops knowing. You cannot be seen. Then my new bow will come in handy. He keeps the eye in his house. It's too valuable to wear out. A wise choice until you show him the error of his ways. Wait for the sun to set, sneak in, and then bring me the eye. Better be worth something. Do you know how much obsidian goes for in Kefalonia? I've never seen it. Exactly. And not only is it obsidian, it's veined with gold. Gold! It's no wonder he saves it for special occasions. So we'll use the profits to pay him off. It will pay for the bulk of it. A vineyard's expensive, you know. I don't know where the Cyclops lives. Keep to the west side of the island. There, you will find his lair. Fine. But you won't get away with being cheap. Cheap? You wound me, Cassandra! It's your defining trait. Bring me the eye and I'll prove you wrong. Remember, not a soul can see you. Got it. Pull this off and our heads won't be the Cyclops' trophies when he comes back. the eye. If it's as valuable as Marco says, it'll be hidden. Huh? <laughs> 
want to be caught here. I need cover. If I'm quiet, I can hide in the bushes. Oh my god. Must be some eye to have that much protection. I have to stay out of view.
You hear about the new bounty on us? Like it's our fault, society makes no room for us. We should go and find them. They'll be on high alert here. 